When I record videos with very strong neodymium magnets, people ask me several times how can you remove them and are these magnets dangerous? I will show you. During the recordings for my video with the title Pulling a car with magnets, something went wrong. But I will show you later. These small magnets appearing harmless. You can put your hand in between and nothing dangerous is happening here. But it is critical when you try to remove them. If you pull it like this, one magnet is falling down. But when I slide the magnet to the side of my hand, the distance between the magnets would decrease and the force of attraction would increase. A higher force means more power and less distance. At the edge of your hand this can be very painful because the distance is getting smaller and smaller and even with these small magnets you have to be very careful if the distance is getting smaller. At some point the critical distance is exceeded and the magnets are colliding. And is it possible to remove a strong neodymium magnet from a steel plate? That is not very easy. But it worked. And I will show you. The magnet has an adhesive force of 200 kg. I'm going to use a winch because even my own weight is not enough. For this purpose I'm attaching one side to a tree stump, the other side to a tree. The cable winch can apply up to 400 kg of force. I am sitting behind the high-end safety wall. You can see that it is possible to pull one steel plate from the magnet. One side is removed. The second steel plate is the tricky one, because I cannot pull anymore. I have to slide the magnet down. With very solid screw clamps I am attaching the steel plate to a post. And then I am hitting the magnet with a hammer out of rubber as far and strong as possible. Can you see that it is not going any further? Um, I would say one more try. And that's why I'm taking a wooden beam as a lever and then pushing the magnet down. In the second run it worked and I could actually remove the magnet. You have seen what an incredible power is behind one of these neodymium magnets. During the recordings for the video where I pull a car with magnets, I was lucky enough to wear extra thick clothes. I was mounting the steel plates to the magnet, but one plate has been attracted much earlier by the magnet. Jetzt wird es ein bisschen dangerous. Okay. Okay. So my thumb has not been pulled out of the area and has been crushed. I could free my thumb because of the thick clothes. Without these clothes the magnet would attach with lower distance to the steel plate and therefore more force of attraction. The hospital found out that it was not broken. But till today you can see a scar. So take care when you are in front of very strong neodymium magnets.